Quickly and quietly, the People's Republic of China is transforming itself into a 21st century military superpower to be reckoned with. China's latest generation Dongfeng Intercontinental Ballistic Missile, the DF-41, is months away from deployment. This newest nuclear missile, touted as the world's longest-range missile, is reputedly capable of striking anywhere within the continental United States. Unlike its predecessors, the DF-41 will not be confined to stationary missile silos, but will be launched from mobile platforms. This formidable new weapon will probably be deployed to the People's Liberation Army's Strategic Rocket Forces bases this year. The DF-41 is the full MIRV nuclear package, carrying 10 independently targetable warheads. With a maximum range of around 9,000 miles, it will be capable of traveling well in excess of Mach 5, reaching the continental United States over the North Pole within a half hour, or traversing the Pacific Ocean to North American targets in a few minutes more than that. Given the number of real reported tests, it is reasonable to speculate the DF-41 will be deployed to PLA Strategic Rocket Force bases in 2016. Richard Fisher Sr. Fellow at the International Assessment and Strategy Center in Washington told the Financial Times, the estimates of the DF-41's speed place it comfortably in the range of hypersonic missiles are well above Mach 5, though China closely guards the particulars of its nuclear program. Experts believe they have a stockpile of about 260 nuclear warheads and could quickly make more. But the U.S. defensive assets in the Pacific mean that any ICBM fired from China to the U.S. would likely be knocked out of the sky within moments. Professor He Kasong, a defense policy specialist at the Shanghai University of Political Science and Law, told the South China Morning Post, No one questions the longest range of the DF-41 is near 15,000 kilometers. But within just a few minutes of being launched, it might be blocked by the U.S. defense system at its Guam naval base. As Canwa Asian Defense notes, Chinese-made Beidou navigation satellites may increase the capabilities of the DF-41 by 2020, but the U.S. is likely to have countered that technology by that time.